Hello guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video I'm going to show you how to fix FIFA 20 not launching or not opening after you press on play. This is a very annoying error that is very common in FIFA 20. I uh, found it in FIFA 19, FIFA 18. So this is a common error in FIFA. I'm going to show you in this video how to fix this if you're getting this error. If you're just simply pressing on play to open up FIFA 20 and it is not opening, you get a task in Task Manager FIFA 20 but it is doing nothing the game is not opening. In this video I'm going to show you what to do if you're getting this error. First of all you're going to have to go into your origin account where you have FIFA 20 and then go to game library or my game library. Go and click on FIFA 20 and then click on the settings button and when you click on the settings button you will have this menu. In this menu you're going to have to click on repair. So what this will do this option will repair the game files and uh, will make sure that uh, the game is fresh all the files are correct and uh, everything is is okay with uh, the important files of the game. So after you repaired the game, make sure you completely log off Origin. Just go and click on Origin and sign out. And then you're gonna have to go and exit out of Origin. Make sure that Origin is uh, closed. Now you're gonna have to press the Windows plus R keys at the same time on your keyboard. And here you're gonna have to type in percentage program data percentage as you see it here then go and click on ok this location will open up locate the folder origin double click on it and from here you're gonna see that these are a bunch of caches folder some logs and stuff like that you can delete everything from here except the local content folder so to make the error disappear we're gonna have to delete all the files from here except the local content folder you don't have to worry about these steps because these steps were uh, recommended by EA support so they are completely safe so as I've said make sure that you delete all the files from here except the local content folder I'm not going to delete the files because I don't have the problem myself now but I've had it so after you delete all the files from here except the local content folder you're gonna have to exit out from here and then press the Windows plus R keys at the same time again and this time we're gonna type in here percentage app data percentage and then go and click on OK we're gonna have to locate the origin folder from here and it will be somewhere around here make sure you delete this origin folder and after you delete the origin folder from the roaming location up here go and click on update go on local and again locate the origin folder from here and of course again delete it so after you deleted all the files that I've showed you, you're going to have to exit out from here and make sure that you restart your PC. After you restart your PC, log back into Origin and try to play FIFA. The problem or the error should be now completely fixed. So I'm hoping that this video helped you and that you managed to fix this annoying problem with FIFA 20. If you liked it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you want more videos like this. If you have any problems or errors that are occur on your Windows operating system, make sure you leave them down below in the comment section of this video. So until next time, have a nice day.